is Richard Ekebus. I am the culinary director of uh, Amber Restaurant, but also the director of food and beverage of the Landmark Mandarin Oriental. I've seen the, the installation for this, the Christmas celebration and uh, it's, it's very pretty and I'm uh, very excited to show my, my children soon uh, the decorations and all the special features that were uh, created for uh, the Christmas celebration. So uh, it's, it's definitely one of the most beautiful decorations in Hong Kong. Well, the VIP reward program is, is one of the most exciting parts of, of this festive celebration because um, uh, one of the options is to have an experience with the Amber team and uh, the Amber kitchen team and the Amber service team and the Amber wine team is to create um, a unique culinary experience for, for your family and friends is to cook with us uh, uh, such a beautiful gourmet menu from basically scratch and to be the hero at the end of the day because we will put you in a position that you have cooked uh, a gourmet two Michelin star uh, awarded menu uh, for your best friends and family. The secret behind some of the dishes is that some are absolute uh, winners because they have a proven track record like the sea urchin, uh, the dulce chocolates and uh, the abalone. They're really the signature dishes of our restaurant. Uh, I have chosen also for a, a beautiful seasonal dish of uh, patis poulade which is served with uh, beautiful kabocha pumpkin, uh, cereals and white truffles. So something very Moorish, very seasonal, very festive um, that we have prepared. Okay, so when we, when we the sauce that we have here, it's uh, the jus of the oxtail. So the oxtail that we have braised, we have roasted it with carrots, with tomatoes, with garlic, with thyme, uh, black pepper. And we have stewed that for a very long time, about 36 hours, very slowly. And then all these uh, beautiful pieces of oxtail, then we, we trim them, we take the meat out, we remove the fat, and we put it out on a tray, we press it, and then we cut it in little rectangulars like that. The jus that we recuperate from, um, from the oxtail, we concentrate, so we reduce the sauce, so a very strong concentration, you get a very beautiful brown sauce. And that sauce is used as a basis for the sauce for the abalone. So it's really a dish of the land and the sea. Um, the oxtail from the land and the abalone from the sea. Because abalone is beautiful texture, but it doesn't have a lot of flavor. So the oxtail really is to give the character to the dish. And, the, and the, the, the spicy tomato sauce, the spicy tomato compote, is to give it some punch with the black pepper. So pure jus of oxtail, very nicely concentrated, and that goes on top. This experience uh, you can have by coming to dine to Amber and order, you know, uh, the items from our seasonal menu. Uh, Amber's always been a restaurant that is very seasonal driven and we have prepared some of the seasonal specialities and some of the signatures for my restaurant. My inspiration really comes through the seasons. Uh, every season will bring uh, a different set of products that we work with and, and as soon as the season starts uh, we, we start to sort of identify the products that we want to highlight in this year's uh, menu and this season's menu and uh, uh, there are some favorites that we have we always love to work with pumpkin in the winter we always love to work with white truffles my favorite dish must be um, um, at the moment, um, the, the, the dish of the poulade with the white truffles, because the season of the white truffles is so short, uh, so I always believe that you really need to take advantage as soon as the season starts, and I think they're now at their best uh, of this, this year's season. Um, I want people to leave Amber uh, with the desire to come back and um, to have some um, that we were able to uh, generate some uh, exceptional emotions during their dinner. Um, I think there's a very important relation between memories and, 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 and a dining experience. And if we were able to trigger some of these memories, I think we did a great job.